Day 122, Tuesday. Take a single day at a time, my friends, because in a single day you had your birth on earth. In a single day you can die unannounced. In a single day you can find the love of a lifetime. In a single day you can change your entire outlook on life. In a single day, you can find the higher power. In a single day, everything can change. Take a single day at a time, my friends. Day 123, Wednesday. The time is always right to be doing the right thing. Day 124, Thursday. Be filled with wonderment. Be touched by love. Believe in miracles. Day 125. Aloha Friday. Today's Hawaiian words of wisdom is, no kind deed has ever lacked its reward. Day 126, Saturday. Breathe more slowly, more deeply. Learn to calm yourself more completely, so you may be at a place of peace in this world. Day 127, Sacred Sunday. Be completely humble and gentle. Be patient, bearing with one another in love. Ephesians 4.2, King James Version. Day 128, Monday. Be grateful. Think of even a single thing you are thankful for. Even if it's just that you're alive and breathing. Day 129, Tuesday. Love is, above all, the gift to oneself, of oneself, and then to others. Day 130, Wednesday. It takes one to know. Day 131, Thursday. Whose love does not rejoice when the sun's infinite luminescence travels its millions of miles through time and space to reach down and touch every sentient life form and once again remind us that our Creator's beauty and goodness permeates our entire world and the universe. Day 132, Aloha Friday. Today's Hawaiian words of wisdom is, love is like the ko'olau breeze, invisible but present nevertheless. Day 133, Saturday. Breathe more deeply. Make every day like Sacred Sunday, your day of rest during stillness or activity. Day 134, Sacred Sunday. By this, everyone will know that you are my disciples if you love one another. 
John 13.35, King James Version. Day 135, Monday. Prayer time can be simple quiet time where you just sit still and breathe. Or it can be a time for asking questions and staying silently receptive to answers and spiritual guidance. Day 136, Tuesday. An endless joyful state results from realizing that God is love, from knowing and serving God, from rejoicing in and praising God, from transmitting God's loving will, from understanding the Creator's purpose for our life. Day 137, Wednesday. Worry not the best is yet to be. Day 138, Thursday. Our guardian angels are intent on obtaining our eternal welfare, and their greatest desire is to see us home in heaven together with them once again. Day 139, Aloha Friday. Today's Hawaiian words of wisdom is braided with cords of love held in bonds of affection. Day 140, Saturday. Scheduling time for prayer is no different than scheduling any other activity, with the exception that prayer may have a profound effect on how the rest of your scheduled appointments work out. Day 141, Sacred Sunday. And so we know and rely on the love God has for us. God is love. Whoever lives in love lives in God and God in them. 1 John 4.16, King James Version. Day 142, Monday. My deepest desires and fondest dreams always seem to come true on a Sunday. If only I could make every day a sacred Sunday. Day 143, Tuesday. Our happiness adds up and multiplies itself as we divide it up and share it with others. Day 144, Wednesday. Heaven is not only as above, so below, but as within, so without. Day 145, Thursday. Many diverse cultures throughout the century have given thanks for many different reasons, and although they may differ in their outward expressions, they all essentially celebrate a gratefulness for life's blessings. Day 146, Aloha Friday. Today's Hawaiian words of wisdom are 
It is natural for people to behave in a loving way. Day 147, Saturday. Each year I have come to increasingly realize that it is the holidays we are blessed to celebrate that make the meaning of life more precious and more sacred. Day 148, Sacred Sunday. For the entire law is fulfilled in keeping this one command. Love your neighbor as yourself. Galatians 5.14, King James Version. Day 149, Monday. In the quiet moments of early dawn or dusk, when our spirits long to write, sing, dance, paint, or draw. Day 150, Tuesday. One day you may discover that your family have become strangers and that what were once strangers have become the family members you just haven't met yet. Day 151, Wednesday. Today we contemplate the sacredness in humanity, rising from the earth and ascending visibly toward the heavens. Day 152, Thursday. My father's sign-off greeting after a conversation always was, now I stretch my hands over the ocean and on the top of your head, and I give you my blessing. Can we not also do this for one another? Day 153, Aloha Friday. Today's Hawaiian words of wisdom are recognize others, be recognized, help others, be helped, be family. Day 154, Saturday. Angels may be called upon to assist us in releasing the burdensome complexities of adult existence and aid us to rediscover the child within so we may be more playful, curious, innocent, and carefree once again. Day 155, Sacred Sunday. Whoever does not love does not know God because God is love. 1 John 4, 8, King James Version. Day 156, Monday. Blessed is the one who comes to us by the way of love, in the way of blessing, on the path of joy. Day 157, Tuesday. In the final analysis then, forgiveness is a gift you give to yourself. Day 158, Wednesday. I know that love is like the sun. It shines its light on everyone. Day 159, Thursday. 
I've often thought that life would be more fulfilling if we reverse the order of existence. That is, start with old age and work our way back to childhood. Day 160, Aloha Friday. Today's Hawaiian words of wisdom are when we meet in love, we shall be whole. Day 161, Saturday, a traditional Irish blessing. May the road rise up to meet you. May the wind be always at your back. May the sun shine warm upon your face. The rains fall soft upon your fields. And until we meet again, may God hold you in the palm of his hand. Day 162, Sacred Sunday. Let the morning bring me word of your unfailing love, for I have put my trust in you. Show me the way I should go, for to you I entrust my life. Psalms 143, King James Version. Today's special prayer is, I sit in stillness, and feel the presence of your Holy Spirit in each and every breath I take. Your presence guides my words, thoughts, and deeds today and every day. Amen. Day 163, Monday. Contentment is not found in the absence of problems, but the ability to face and resolve them. Day 164, Tuesday. To expand my heart size ten times over still would never do to hold all the love I have in my heart just for you. Day 165, Wednesday. The way you live your life is your gift to those who come after. Make it a beautiful one. Day 166, Thursday. We, too, are never alone, even when we don't know it. God is always watching over us. Day 167, Aloha Friday. The Hawaiian words of wisdom for today are, make your minds align. Turn your mind to the same channel with bright thoughts. Day 168, Saturday. Whatever the question, love is the answer. Day 169, Sacred Sunday. Today's focus is on gentleness. And beside this, Giving all diligence, add to your faith, virtue. Add to virtue, knowledge. Add to knowledge, temperance. Add to temperance, patience. Add to patience, godliness. Add to godliness, kindness. And to kindness, Love. Second Peter one five through seven, King James Version. 
Day 170, Monday. After all is said and done, remember me as loving you. Day 171, Tuesday. The most cherished qualities of life seem to be the childlike qualities of wonder and innocence. Day 172, Wednesday. Peace does not necessarily mean to be in a place where there is no turbulence, trouble, or hard work. Peace means to be in the midst of all these things and still be calm in your mind and gentle in your heart. Day 173, Thursday. Whenever you have felt at peace or in a deeper state of contentment while in a nature-filled or natural setting, you may well have been in the company of one or more angels. Day 174, Aloha Friday. Today's Hawaiian words of wisdom are, listen carefully, observe with the eyes, work with the hands. Day 175, Saturday. Life is a gift to you they have breathed it into you at the beginning from our creators. Day 176, Sacred Sunday. Today's focus is on joy. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He maketh me to lie down in green pastures. He leadeth me beside the still waters. He restoreth my soul. He leadeth me in the paths of righteousness for his name's sake. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil for thou art with me. Thy rod and thy staff, they comfort me. Thou preparest a table before me in the presence of mine enemies. Thou anointest my head with oil. My cup runneth over. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Psalms 23, King James Version. Day 177, Monday. May you always have love to share, health to spare, and friends and family that care. Day 178, Tuesday. It is health that is real wealth and not pieces of gold or silver. Day 179, Wednesday. A joy shared with another is doubled. A sorrow shared with another is reduced by half. Day 180, Thursday. When I stopped dwelling on my problems in life, I began finding the answers in living. Day 181, Aloha Friday. Today's Hawaiian words of wisdom are 
love all that you see, including yourself. 